So what I'm doing is I'm getting ready to start swinging wickets tomorrow for uh, Coho. So I've got Nick's rod here, and he's got the Twitch Lamb Glass rod here. It's perfect for swinging uh, wickets for these call these Coho. So um, tomorrow we're going to start off with pink and chartreuse. You know, it's a great color here on the Quinault. Can't go wrong. We got about a 34, 35 inch leader, and uh, we'll be running half ounce inline sinkers tomorrow, and casting and swinging these for Coho. So uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. Excited to see what's going to happen in the morning. So uh, let's go get them, guys. Big coho, fuck. Big coho. Oh. The way I was fishing these things is I'm casting across the river, it's pretty much straight out, yeah. not upstream hardly at all. Pretty much straight up or maybe even a little bit down. What I'm do doing is after it hits the water is I'm just lowering my rod tip and letting it try to find bottom, but it's been able to just sweep. Like the old days, we used to swing spoons like Bill Herzog. Probably one of the best guys I've ever seen with spoons. And uh, so it's the same theory and everything. And when you feel the lead tick at the tail end of your uh, run, then you reel in nice and slow and they'll follow it right to the boat and hit. It's just incredible.